Hello there, and thanks for joining the Strive to Fitness podcast with our fitness coach, Aaron Walker, who's going to take you through the positive reinforcement program of weight loss, self-confidence, exercise routines, and proper nutrition. Good to go? Aaron Walker is ready. And now, here's our host and personal trainer, Aaron Walker. Thanks for casting in. Our topic today is about cholesterol and the effects on men and women. There are some people who may deny that there are differences between the sexes when it comes to cholesterol. But you should know that regardless the differences, both are being affected from high cholesterol. You will find that many scientists will help you to determine the differences between men and women so that you can determine how cholesterol affects you. You should know that men and women have different hormones and you will find that cholesterol works in different ways in men and women. If you do the proper research, you can learn about the differences in steroids in your body. You'll also notice that men are less likely to care about what they eat, but they are less likely to exercise for the benefit of being healthier, but it's more to look better for the opposite sex. Men are also a lot less likely to go to the doctor for a problem that could be something serious. For these reasons, men run a higher risk of having high cholesterol at an earlier age. It may be obvious that women are more likely to be healthier with their lifestyles. However, this doesn't mean that they are not at risk for having high cholesterol or avoiding heart disease. Did you know that women are less likely to respond quickly to a heart attack than men? Even though many women think that breast cancer is a top risk for their sex, this is actually not true. It's actually heart disease. There are so many women who believe that they need to worry about breast cancer but they really should be thinking about their chances of having a heart attack. This is why drastically higher numbers of women die of their first heart attack when compared to the number of male fatalities for the same reason. Even though men and women are very different, you will find that there is one thing that both of the sexes have in common, and that is being able to change their future. Yes, it's true. You can change your future by starting to become healthy and maintaining a healthy cholesterol level. You will find that if you start yourself on a diet that will limit your fat intake, you may be able to save yourself from a heart attack. You'll also find that there are saturated fats, sugars, and alcohol that you need to avoid in order to decrease your cholesterol. However, don't forget that the body doesn't need some fats and sugars for it to perform. You will want to do everything that you can to stay active and also maintain a healthy lifestyle. By doing these things, you'll find that you'll be able to control your weight And with that, you will be able to increase your good cholesterol, but you will also be able to decrease the bad cholesterol. You may also want to take some fiber supplements so that you can keep your cholesterol levels just right and you'll be able to dispose the bad cholesterol before it enters your bloodstream. There are so many things that you can do to keep your cholesterol under control. But before you change anything, please make sure you consult your doctor about what's best for you. Thanks again for casting in. We'll talk to you next time. If you have been motivated by this episode of Strive to Fitness Podcast, ensure to subscribe and share with your friends and team. Also, if you have any questions, visit strivetofitness.com or send an email to strivetofitness1 at gmail.com. See you next time.